welcome to this episode of That's Good Science, where we celebrate scientists that push the limits of technology, helping us learn so much more with a great deal less. Today, we tip our hats to a team of caring researchers who've been working on increasing their sensitive sides, or at least the sensitivity of their transcriptomic assays. So, while gene expression profiling by microarrays has been around since the mid-90s, the development of massively parallel DNA sequencing in the late 2000s is rapidly overtaking microarray analysis in popularity. Because, really, who could resist using a technology with the word massive in it? The only thing better would be massively parallel sequencing on extremophiles. But I digress. One limit to RNA sequencing technology is sensitivity. These experiments are typically done using large populations of cells with limits down to roughly 10 nanograms of RNA or RNA extracted from 50 to 100 cells. But understanding behavior at the single cell level is critical for many systems, a direct example being cancer, where differences between individual tumor cells can lead to different health outcomes. Getting that single cell data has not been easy. In order to demolish the 50 to 100 cell barrier, Ramsgold and colleagues needed a super-sensitive and accurate cDNA synthesis method. CloneTech's Smarter Technology was the answer. This led to the development of the Smarter Ultra-Low RNA Kit for Illumina sequencing that delivers reliable transcript profiling, all the way down to the single cell level. This translates into a mere 10 picograms of RNA. As a proof of principle, Ramsgold and colleagues show how their technique can be performed on a single circulating tumor cell, ushering in a new regime for sensitivity, not just for studying cancer transcriptomes, but for understanding the transcriptomes of single cells in a multitude of systems. And that's good science.